Two months ago, this phone box was covered in graffiti and broken glass. Now it's been reborn as a craft coffee shop. But despite having planning permission, it's landed the owner in hot water with the council. They started issuing us fines. The reason being, apparently, we have usage to sell coffee inside the box, but we're not allowed to stand, stand outside the box and sell coffee. So basically, if you want to buy a coffee, it means that I have to be inside making the coffee and you have to be inside buying the coffee off me. So this is the phone box. Can you actually literally physically fit two people inside? Yeah, you're joking with me. We can just about fit the equipment in here. So what options are you left with? No options. The only way we can serve is by standing outside. Locals say the phone box, which now comes with a full-time barista, has become a meeting point in Turnham Green. Before they were there simply as decoration, but now they have an actual use. It gives us something to uh, do, come over, sit down, have a nice cup of tea, have a chat. And of course, it makes for a great photo op too. I always wondered what happens to this uh, uh, phone booth, the old one, and nobody's using it anymore, and it was amazing, so I wanted to make a straight away picture for Instagram. <laughs> The council say anyone trading on the street must have a street trading licence. Whether or not they also have a building with planning permission. They say Mr Mehmet has since submitted an application for a licence and this is being considered by the council. Mustafa has already spent £10,000 on the phone box coffee shop. But unless he gets council permission, it, like many others in London, could fall back into disrepair. Sam Holder, ITV News.